Virginia Tech researchers are developing a new weapon in the fight against climate change. The National Institute of Environmental Health Sciences wrapped up a challenge asking research teams across the country to develop computer applications to help keep people safe. WSLS 10's Bethany Teague has the story behind Virginia Tech's first place app. Here is the problem. With the changing climate, we expect more extreme weather. Here is one solution to help emergency managers protect their communities. The it will show you the countywide. Three Virginia Tech researchers have come up with an online app called Population Infrastructure and Exposures Visualization, or PIVIS for short. It can be used by many uh, different kinds of people. Users can click on any lower 48 state in the U.S. and any and county in that uh, state. There, they will get data on power outages, uh, temperatures, pollutants, and the number of socially isolated people. Socially isolated means those who come into contact with few to no people on a typical day. What if there is a big power outage at the height of summer in this particular region? This app will inform emergency managers, first responders, and public health officials about who is the most vulnerable in these types of crisis situations and how they should prioritize resources. Climate change is much more difficult and it's a much harder thing to get your hands around. Julia Golke was a public health professional before she began working on the PiViz app. She says although PiViz was specifically designed to address long-term climate change, it can be immediately useful. It's relevant now. All of these kind of threats that are associated with climate change are actually threats right now. So heat waves have always been an issue. All the app's data can be downloaded for free. Plans are in the works to expand and update PiViz as populations change and emergencies strike. In Blacksburg, Bethany T, WSLS 10. PiViz is web-based only right now, but the team hopes to get money to make it a mobile-friendly app in the near future.